Hey, how's it going guys? I've been talking a lot about Oro 3D and how awesome I think it is, but I know a lot of you guys out there don't have an Oro 3D system, Aaron. <laughs> so I decided that it might be a cool idea to do a binaural recording of my favorite demo from the Oro 3D demo disc, which is the tractor demo. I have some binaural mics from Sonic Presence. They're awesome and uh, you gotta look out for them. Theater is a little bit messy right now, but let me kind of just go through and show you guys what I have in here and um, we'll give you a demo. Before we start this demo, get your best pair of headphones because the binaural demo will only work with headphones. It's not gonna work with speakers, not gonna work with your phone, so don't even try it. I mean, whatever you're hearing there, it doesn't mean anything. Headphones. Okay, so for front speakers, I have the Larson 4.2s behind the screen. I'm using a Polk Reserve R200, and so another Larson there. For the side surrounds, I'm using some Wharfdale uh, Diamond 12.1s. For the rears, rear surround, I have PSB Alpha P5s. And for the height speakers, I'm using some SVS Prime Elevation speakers. And yeah, it's a crazy mix, so I have some in the back. And on the front, front heights, rear heights. So alternatively, you could have them um, on the sides as well, but this is an option as well. I am using a uh, Mica 000 center channel and the crazy thing is you'll notice these are all different speakers and that's for a reason. So over here on this corner, I'm using a Monoprice Monolith THX10. That is that crazy beast over there. The THX 13 inch sub SB3000, which is not in use right now. And over there, uh, SVS PB1000 Pro. I have a Denon X4700H, and the reason I'm using this is mainly because of Oro. I do prefer to use uh, Dirac instead of Odyssey, and that's why I have this Mini DSP DDRC88A. So this is an eight channel Dirac enabled device. So I run the pre-outs here into this, and that um, handles everything. The front channels are handled by this Parasound A52 Plus, five channel amplifier. Ignore my my uh, rig here, <laughs> it's temporary. Um, and then, so I need to power some more channels. How do I do that? So some of the channels are powered by this because this is only handling five, but I have many more speakers than that. So uh, four of them I believe are powered by this. And then for the other speakers, I have two of them powered by this Yamaha AS501. And I think the center, the voice of God channel is handled by this uh, small mica app. So I'm gonna be changing all that out in the near future, but I just wanna give you guys a quick demo of how the Oro 3D sounds in here. Right now I'm using the binaural mics. I'm speaking at the same volume as I was earlier. I did have to turn it down because this is gonna be a loud demo and I wanna keep the dynamic range. So turn up your volume so that it matches what my voice level was at earlier. So here we go. Denon X4700H using the NVIDIA Shield. I have this pretty loud. I have it at, let's see, minus 10 dB. And Zero dB is reference. May I have your attention, please? May I have your attention, please? You are about to experience now the future of sound based on a revolutionary new system called Oro 3D. The next recording is made in the European countryside. Notice that the birds are up in the trees. Listen to the donkey in the background. Then the church bells, followed by the tractor passing. Witness how much more realistic the tractor sound is when the addition of all the height channels are engaged.
just for fun, here's a demo using the Voice of God channel. We call that the Voice of God channel, which allows the reproduction of sounds coming from directly above the listener. Here are two examples of recordings made at an airport. Experience how capable the oral 3D system is at reproducing the exact position of an airplane as it passes by, from taking off to flying directly overhead, and finally disappearing above and behind you. In this next demo, helicopters will slowly creep up from the back of the theater. Close your eyes and feel them fly overhead. Without back height surround speakers, it's impossible to reproduce natural flyover effects. Oral 3D makes cinema feel like you're really there, participating in the action. From subtle natural environments to music and the rumblings of our mechanized world, the emotional impact provided by height information can now unfold around you. All right, so what did you guys think about that? To me, it sounds pretty amazing. Hopefully that came through. With the binaural recording, I hope you're using headphones because that's the only way to really experience it. Did you hear that crazy bass rumble? I know that's not the oral part, but uh, that you definitely have to have subs to get the full experience. But um, how did it sound? Like, did it sound immersive? Did you get the, the feeling that you were actually there? Um, hopefully you did. And uh, that's pretty much it. If you like the video, make sure to like, subscribe, share this if you think it was useful. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Bye-bye.